this is Dwight Norris of fishnetwork.com and here I am on the Mystic River. Uh, we actually went to the upper Mystic Lake and there was a bass fisherman in there and he, uh, he had caught three small bass off a, uh, hmm, what was it? A, it was like a white um, jerk bait. And there was another bass fisherman there on the shore fishing the lower Mystic Lake and he had black and blue spinner baits and black and blue chatter baits and he said they were killing the black and blue black and blue chatterbaits for a while and they hit a couple times a day but the herring everywhere the seagulls are coming down onto the the little causeway there that goes to the uh hmm, the uh, little boat marina and they're just destroying them and the herring is everywhere everywhere i saw like two yellow perch and they weren't biting and i actually had a live worm on and a blue gull actually went up sniffed the live worm and then walked away. I've never seen that before. At the Charles River, when you see a bluegill nearby and there's a live bait in the, the vicinity, they just swallow it all the way down to the stomach. No no thoughts. So I'm not sure what's going on here at the, just the Mystic Lakes and the Mystic uh, River, but it's not so pretty. It's really shallow here, the tide's out. Um, there's a storm coming now. You see it's, it's getting a little bit darker. It was been bright all day long. In about half an hour, it's gonna start thundering. We're gonna have to get out of here. But right now, we're still trying to find the bass. Apparently, Sorry, I cut out there. Uh, we're gonna keep trying for a little bit longer and see if we can catch some some bass. Um, right now, I'm like, Ugh, this is not pretty over here. Maybe I should have gone to Horn Pond again. I've seen bass, I've hooked the bass, and I've caught the bass. And I know they're there, and they're happy, and they're gonna eat. Plus, I wanna hit the uh, the northern side where I've heard their trout at, where the stream comes in. So, maybe next time. Today, no boat. I know it's the weekend, but got things to do other than fishing. Some days I fish, some days I don't. That's the choice I have because I manage my time. So, if you want to go fishing at work Monday through Friday and even on the weekends, please go to the website, fishingatwork.com, get your 10-step process to go fishing at work. Also, if you have any questions, go down below and click the subscribe button, click the like button if you like it. And if you don't, well, sorry. Please leave a comment down below to tell me how I can do it better. One, keep further away from the camera. So, when you get to work this week, think Fishing Network. Hey, just taking a quick video of these two turtles, maybe three, fighting, probably over a mate. They are going at it, or maybe they're mating. Actually, I don't know if they're fighting or mating. It looks like they're fighting. So they look like uh, snapping turtles. I thought they were herring. See their mouths like open. Yeah, their mouths are opening, so they're probably gonna bite each other. But I thought they were herring, but it turns out they're turtles. Wait, Daddy, remember that day when we looked at it and it was really close to it? Oh yeah, that. And now it's over there, so they're yeah. getting pretty used to snapping turtles. Yeah, that snapping turtle we saw last time was as big as you. I don't think I've never seen that one that big. No, it was like one inch oh. bigger than me. One inch. Drop my rod. Sorry. Wait, are they coming near us or are they getting farther than us? It doesn't matter. They're going after each other. Anyway, thought you might like to see it.